What's up guys? I am back with another box of treats and this month they are coming from Mexico. So I'm just going to read this little card here. It says, this month's treats come to you from the beautiful country of Mexico, officially named as the Estados Unidos Mexicanos United Mexican States. Mexico is the third largest country in Latin America and the 14th largest country in the whole world. It is also home to um, 34 UNESCO um, World Heritage Sites. One of which includes the Kukulikan. Kukulikan. Also, I apologize if I'm not pronouncing this correctly. But the Kukulikan Pyramid, which is shown on the front of this card. Sorry for the light in the back. But it says, more than 13,000 years ago, the Mayans and Aztec built pyramids in Mexico, which, unlike Egyptian ones, were primarily meant for worship and other ceremonies. Okay. We got a couple did you knows. Did you know that Mexico is the world's largest Spanish 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 speaking countries? Um, the, let's see, the Chihuahua is the world's smallest dog and is named for a Mexican state. Interesting, I never knew that. And then, of course, we have what's inside your treats box, and they uh, tell us the names and what they are. So let's go ahead and dig right in. First, I saw, which I've already tried. Takis! These are pretty spicy. But let's see. Takis Fuego are hot chili pepper and lime flavored tortilla chips. Enjoyed by those who love hashtag extra spicy treats. Its product tail tagline is like fire walking in your tongue. Check out the Takis Fuego challenge trend online. Okay. Still gonna try these. I know I love them, but I feel like every video I struggle with opening up these packages, so do not judge me. But this is what they look like if you've never tried them before. It's like a rolled up chip, but they are very spicy, so I'm only gonna eat probably half of one. Muy bueno. Very good. Got our little napkin here. Okay. Let's see. Our next treat. Carlos V. And it says Nestle's right there. So I'm going to assume that it's chocolate. Let's see. <clears throat> Named after Carlos V. The King of Chocolates has been a staple chocolate bar in Mexico since the 70s. With its rich smell and unique powdery taste, you will better understand why Mexicans think this is the number one chocolate. Please excuse my dog barking in the background. I might pause this. Sorry about that. I also grabbed a water. Okay. So back with the Carlos V, the king of chocolates. Let's see. Okay, with its rich smell and unique powdery taste, you will better understand why Mexicans think this is the number one chocolate. Okay. Please ignore the background noise. There's nothing I can do. But, ooh, it's got some writing on it. Let's see. Mm. I like it. I like it. It's alright. Moving on. Moving on up. Oh, there's two of these. Alright, let's see. Bo Bocadin? Bocadin? By... Ricolini. This classic Mexican candy favorite is a combination of crispy thin peanut 
peanut wafers coated in delicious and creamy chocolate. Excellent for sharing, but we think you'll finish a bar before you know it. That might not be the case today. But, we're still going to try it. Little chocolate, little chocolate bar. Mmm. Oh, yes. Little chocolate wafer. That's good. I'm not sure which one I like more, though. And again, on the back, same as last time, there's a best, worst, and weirdest. So far, um, I'm not sure where to put these. So, let's move on. Now, what are these? Oh, mini marshmallows. Bianchi. Bianchi mini mini. Um, artificial flavors. They're strawberry, orange, vanilla, lemon, and banana. Excuse my brother in the background. He's raging on this game. Let's see. Regular little marshmallows. Mmm. I think this is a good idea. I think I would use these on my s'mores, honestly. Just a few of them. Um, and there's one more snack. There's one more snack left. This is called the Pulparindo. It's made with real fruit. Also, I did not read the description about the marshmallows because, well, they're marshmallows. Alright, so let's see. Pulparindo by De La Rosa is a chili and tamarind flavored candy bar. Candy enjoyed by millions of Mexicans. It's spicy, one of a kind taste is definitely a taste of Mexico and a reflection of the country's unique love for spicy treats. Okay, so spicy as well as the Takis, also spicy. But we're gonna, we're gonna try this because I'm wondering if it's like a gummy or I don't know. Oh, okay. Let's see. It's it looks almost like a taffy. Oh, that's sticking right to it. We're just gonna try a little piece because it's don't know how spicy it can get. Oh. Ooh. It's got a Ooh, got a strange taste to it. It's kind of strong. Oh. Unfortunately, I have to put this under the worst only because it tastes very strange to me. It could be under the worst and the weirdest. I'm not really sure what would be the worst. But I can tell you what is the best, and it's got to be the Takis. Although they're extremely hot, I absolutely love the flavor. You can find these at your local Walmart. But alright then. Um, that was today's video, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in. I apologize again for all the background noise. But, again, there's nothing I can do about that. Um, stay tuned for next month's box of treats. So far, we've got a box of treats from Indonesia and this month, um, Mexico. So, uh, let's see what happens next. Peace.